One of the first phone calls I made when I decided to do Spamalot was I called Jimmy Merritt. He is our music director. He comes in and he is really wonderful at working with the actors. One, two, ready, sing. I'm feeling much better about all this music now that um, you guys are learning your parts. <laughs> in some ways he tricks them. He will take songs that are really, really fast, like Knights of the Round Table, and he will start them off really, really slow. He'll get the actors working through it. Okay, but of course, you know it goes much faster than that. So let's we'll slowly build up the tempo. One, two, three. Run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run, 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 run away. And then he'll say, okay, a little bit faster now. Okay, a little bit more faster, a little bit more faster, a little bit more faster. And he'll work them up into a frenzy so that they're going 100 miles an hour. Run away, run away, run away. That way, when he brings them back down to the place where they're supposed to be singing, he tricks the actors into thinking, oh, okay, well, that's not so bad. Because we're not yet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, go! Not yet, yet. He understands the comedy of the show. He is a very big Python fan himself, and that is very important to me, is that we have people working in all facets of the production, not just with the music, but with the set and the lighting and everything else, but people who understand what makes Python work. That, amongst his many other talents, is what I am very appreciative of Jimmy for. We're knights of the round table, we dance whenever we want. We do routines and gorgeous scenes with footwork impeccable. We dine well here in Camelot, we need Good job. <laughs> we are off to a start. <laughs>